హలో అండ్ వెల్కమ్ టు డాక్టర్ అనిమ ఉపాధ్యాయస్ యూట్యూబ్ ఛానల్ ఇన్ దిస్ వీడియో వీ విల్ లర్న్ ద క్వశ్చన్స్ అండ్ దర్ ఆన్సర్స్ ఆన్ ద టాపిక్ రెడ్ వుడ్ విస్కోమీటర్ దిస్ టాపిక్ ఈస్ ఈక్వలీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ ఫర్ యువర్ ల్యాబ్ ఎగ్జామ్ యాజ్ వెల్ యాజ్ యువర్ థియరీ పేపర్ సో బిఫోర్ వీ బిగిన్ దిస్ వీడియో let me first remind you to please subscribe to my channel if you have not done it so far whenever you are working on redwood viscometer or there is a question on redwood viscometer in your theory paper the most important and relevant question is define viscosity and your answer should be that viscosity is defined as the resistance offered by the different layers of the liquid to its own flow it is an important property of a liquid how is viscosity and temperature related viscosity varies inversely with temperature as the temperature rises the viscosity of the liquid decreases how is viscosity related to mobility or fluidity mobility means ease to flow thus a less viscous liquid will flow easily therefore viscosity is inversely related to mobility or fluidity state the units to express viscosity in si units it is expressed as poissoule or pascal second the kinematic viscosity is square meter per second in cgs unit it is expressed as poise or centipoise what is the importance of determination of viscosity of a lubricant it is important to determine the viscosity of a given lubricant before applying it to any machinery because we all know that the performance of the machinery depends upon the lubricants employed for lubrication a rapid change in viscosity may lead to wear and tear of the machine and its parts the viscosity of a good lubricant should not change rapidly with rise in temperature even a prolonged use should not bring a big change in viscosity at working temperatures if we know all these things we can apply a given oil as a lubricant especially if the machine is working at high temperatures what is the rate of change of viscosity with temperature called the rate of change of viscosity with temperature is called viscosity index what does viscosity index indicate and how it is abbreviated viscosity index indicates the resistance of an oil to the changes in viscosity with temperature and it is abbreviated as vi both in capitals what is the difference between viscosity and viscosity index viscosity is a property which tends to decrease as the temperature rises whereas viscosity index indicates the resistance of an oil to the changes in viscosity with temperature what is the difference between redwood viscometer number 1 and 2 it is the diameter of the jet or orifice for the efflux of the oil which is different in redwood viscometer number 1 and 2 the diameter of the orifice is only 1.62 mm in redwood viscometer number 1 and it is 3.8 mm in redwood viscometer number 2 as a result of which the outflow of oil takes around 2000 seconds or less in redwood viscometer number 1 and in redwood viscometer number 2 it is just 1 tenth of the flow time of the redwood viscometer number 1 is the principle and working of redwood viscometer 1 and 2 same yes the principle and working are same besides redwood viscometer give the names of other viscometers employed for the determination of viscosity and viscosity index the viscometers that are commonly used are angler 
Sebold and Oswald viscometers. What type of viscometer is Oswald viscometer? Oswald viscometer is also called capillary viscometer and it is made up of glass. What is the unit of viscosity index? Viscosity index has no units. It is a ratio. What are the similarities and differences between Redwood, Angler and Seibold viscometer? So there is only one similarity and that similarity is that the cup in which the test sample, the oil is taken is made up of brass and it is provided with thermometer which works electrically. The differences are that the jet which is provided in the cup is closed with a small metallic ball which can be lifted up or down using a wire closing the jet in redwood viscometer. The jet is closed by a valve rod which can be lifted vertically through the lid in the angular viscometer and the jet has a cork stopper that can be pulled downward using a small chain or rope in Seibold viscometer. And the second difference is the collecting flask in redwood viscometer. The capacity of the collecting flask is 50 ml. In the angler, the collecting flask is double bulbed and in the Seibold viscometer, it is a 60 ml capacity flask with a funnel like mouth. How is viscosity index expressed mathematically? It is expressed as L minus U divided by L minus H multiplied by 100 where U is the viscosity of the sample under test. H and L are the viscosities of Pennsylvanian and Gulf oils. How is viscosity index determined through redwood viscometer? The viscosity index of the given oil is calculated through the slope from the graph. The flow of the oil is recorded as viscosity at different temperatures. And the same is plotted in graph as viscosity versus temperature and log viscosity versus temperature and the slope is calculated. What is the viscosity index of gulf oil and why? The viscosity index of gulf oil is arbitrarily fixed at zero as it is rich in alicyclic and naphthenic hydrocarbons whose viscosity changes rapidly with the change in temperature. What is the viscosity index of Pennsylvanian oil and why? The viscosity index of Pennsylvanian oil is arbitrarily fixed at 100 as it is rich in paraffinic hydrocarbons which has a very little or no change in its viscosity with change in temperature. What viscosity index is desirable in a good quality oil? And why? A high viscosity index is desirable in a good quality oil because a high viscosity index suggests very little or no change in the viscosity with rise in temperature. What does a low viscosity index of an oil suggest? A low viscosity index of an oil suggests that its viscosity will change rapidly with the change in temperature. What is coefficient of viscosity? It is the measure of the degree to which a fluid resists to flow under applied force. In simple words, it is the amount of resistance offered by a liquid to resist its flow. How is coefficient of viscosity denoted and what is its SI unit? It is denoted by the Greek letter eta. And in SI unit, it is expressed as Pascal second, same as viscosity. 1 Pascal second is equal to 1 kilogram meter inverse second inverse. Is viscosity and coefficient of viscosity same? No. Viscosity is defined as the resistance between two adjacent layers of a liquid. Whereas, coefficient of viscosity is the tendency of that resistance between two layers. That is the force required per unit area to maintain a unit 
relative velocity between two layers of fluid which are a unit distance apart does coefficient of viscosity of a liquid varies inversely with temperature yes the coefficient of viscosity of a liquid decreases with rising temperature how does the coefficient of viscosity of gases related to temperature in gases the coefficient of viscosity is directly proportional to temperature it rises with rising temperature does the coefficient of viscosity constant for a given liquid at a given temperature yes it is constant for a given liquid at a given temperature because it is an intrinsic property of that liquid what is the significance of determining viscosity and viscosity index of a lubricating oil it is important to determine the viscosity and viscosity index of a given oil because a good lubricant should have a high viscosity index whose viscosity will not change rapidly with rising temperature the viscosity should not change even at high working temperatures at which the machine works and the vis viscosity should be same even after a prolonged use can you identify the apparatus looking at their images a b c and d a is redwood viscometer looking at the collecting flask which is a small flask of around 50 ml capacity b is oswald viscometer which is a capillary viscometer made up of glass c is angler viscometer look at the collection flask double bulbed and d is sebold viscometer where the collection flask is larger of 60 ml capacity and the mouth is shaped into a funnel so i have almost covered all the possible questions that could be asked in your lab as well as your theory paper if you have any more queries don't hesitate to put them in the comment box i will definitely come back to you keep watching my videos also share the video among your friends and don't forget to like it important links i will give in the description box take care of yourself